guys um a couple of videos back i made a video about uh, a company called review kick and how you can use them to get free amazon products and all you have to do is basically um <clears throat> write a review it doesn't have to be positive or negative but it should be like your honest opinion about the product that you got and according to the this about 16 hours ago or so um, rules have changed on Amazon so let's figure out what is going on so in terms um, terms of service update regarding customer reviews and basically the big news here is One thing Amazon has made clear is that against their terms to post a review in exchange for compensation, including a free or discounted product, make sure that they're following these rules. We no longer request or require any customer who buys something with a coupon to leave a review. So apparently maybe this um, service is still going to continue. It's just that they're not going to request or require you to leave a review. Um, I'm assuming that if you don't leave reviews, you're probably not going to get um, chosen for you know other discounted products. So there probably is like a rating system on the other end where the companies rate the customers that are actually buying the products through Review Kick. That would only make sense to me. This is all my guess. So, um, let's see. So, it's still okay. So, you can still get the coupons as long as you don't request, require, exchange it for a review. So, they're going to think about this and possibly make changes later. And it looks like the actual, from the customer end, not too much has changed except you're not really, you shouldn't feel obligated to make a review. Although, I'm sure that is going to kind of, that's the reason that companies give out these coupons is for the reviews. So, so starting October 3rd I mean anything that's like in the mail coming to you now I guess there's no uh, requirement for a review they should um, in our opinion this would be similar to purchasing a full product full price product So this is more um, information from the kind of like the company end and since I focus on the consumer end I'm just trying to see this might be the end of you know the the kind of free ride that was review kick <clears throat> not exactly free but Yep, there you go. That's Oh, okay. Um, Amazon prohibits incentivized reviews unless they're facilitated through Amazon's Vine program. This means that starting today, Amazon will not allow any product reviews that were given in exchange for discounted or free product. Now, to me, I didn't see this wording anywhere else. I mean, this is the first time I'm coming across this. But... At first it seemed like, okay, you can still get discounts, you can still leave reviews and stuff like that, but now here it says that they will not allow any product reviews 
even if you put that little disclaimer on there. So I'm sure that this review kick program is probably coming to an end right now. I think it's done. I can't see any reason companies would give their stuff out for free if there was no expectation for someone to give a review for it on the other end. And there you go. So it looks like right now there's a gray area where reviewers don't know if they should be posting a review. Um, because if you apparently put that little disclaimer that you got it for a discount in exchange for your honest opinion, uh, that's against Amazon. But if you review it and you don't say that, then that's against the FTC, as it says right here. So, yeah, you, I guess right now, honestly, the best thing to do is not to leave a review at all. And just wait and see. However, I feel like if you don't leave a review, you're probably... Um, not going to be selected for to review other products. So, honor system. See, people are more worried about, well, does this mean the end of my discounted and free stuff? I'm saying that probably not this week, but eventually in about probably like a week or so, this thing's going to come to an end. That's what I feel like. And this guy says these giveaway sites aren't going anywhere. Won't have to do anything for the free products now. Does that even make sense? Why would companies just give stuff out for free for no reason? And there you go. So here's a little bit of the uh, you know community comments on it. And uh, that's just the point I wanted to make because I feel the responsibility to tell you guys this since I did show you um, the website review kick and and how to kind of get yourself involved in this. I should at least put this out there in the same platform to let you know that um, you know you don't want to put your Amazon account into jeopardy and you don't want to break the FTC laws and I don't know so just make an informed decision for yourself and uh, I hope this video was helpful